Industry that is Italian football thrives on glory. It demands success. Three times champions of the world. The Italians don't hope to be here at the Olympic Stadium on July the 8th for the final. They expect to be. It was a beautiful afternoon in Rome, as you can see. And it's going to be red hot tonight. The temperature's rising, the heat is on. Austria stand in the way of a dream start for the hosts of the 1990 World Cup. Well, a very good evening uh, from ITV and National Power. Well, one man who has stood here in triumph flew in this morning, Emlyn Hughes, who led Liverpool to glory here in the European Cup, the first time that Liverpool won it way back in 1977 against Borussia Mönchengladbach. Evening, Emlyn. I said the, the old stadium's changed a wee bit. Well, it has, yes. I mean, as you so rightly say, 1977 is a day that I'll never, ever forget. And I was proud to be the first Liverpool captain ever to pick up the trophy. And I thought it was a good stadium then, but they've made £140 million pounds worth of amendments and improvements to it. And I'd like to think that we could do that to England, to our stadium, but I'd, I don't ever think that we'll host a World Cup again, which is another point, but a sad point. Very briefly, I mean, is it a big void when you look back on your career that you never played in a World Cup Finals? It's a major void and the only disappointment I never had. I played in four build-ups to World Cup, 70, 74, 78 and 82, but never actually kicked a ball in a World Cup uh, final competition, so I'm very sad about that. Never well, mind. <laughs> second best, isn't it? Being here with ITV. It, yeah. Well, the match kicks off uh, on the hour. Also tonight, we'll have uh, updates, reports from the England, Scotland and the Republic of Ireland camps. Well, there were two uh, important matches here in the World Cup play this afternoon. So for details and action of those, and much more as well, I'm sure, Nick Owen in London.